paid John, attention. didn't you work on a reality show? Didn't you, I, ju I, you judge? I did, but I was a horrible judge. I was a horrible, horrible judge, <laughs> and I had some time What off. makes a good judge? You actually um, a good Somebody judge. who doesn't have uh, enough talent of their own. <laughs> to, to, to like, like Randy Jackson. I, no, no. <laughs> Randy Jackson Whoa. is very talented. Wow. You know? <laughs> but I, I mean, I know what it feels like to be judged, you know, and, you know, I'm not going to lie to you, it hurts. You know, and it's like when you go, when you put everything, every part of yourself into something and then, and then, you know, somebody just flicks a pen carelessly across a page and it can really, it can really hurt. So you're just too nice. That's no, I'm not too nice. It's just that, that I just don't, I didn't, I didn't feel like I was, I had any right judging what anybody else did. Hmm. And I wanted to be really constructive. And if somebody asked me to work with them to help them do something better, I would. You know, but, but to sit in judgment of other people, it's, it's nothing but subjectivity, you know? Are those shows a good thing? I think ultimately they wind up cheating the artists out of longevity, uh, out, of, out of developing a real career and their own voice. Because I know that a lot, and there's a, you know, you have, you, whether you like them or not, the people that win those contests are very, very talented singers. And I, I believe that the way that they're set up is a little unfair to, the, to them. I think that's a good point.